Good evening, I'm Karen Devine. And I'm John White. New development site on the battle over drive through restaurants in the city of Palm Desert tonight. The city council rejecting a proposal that would have allowed them in more areas. News Channel 3's Jake Ingrassi live in Palm Desert tonight with more on tonight's decision. And Jake, this has been an issue that's been debated for years in Palm Desert and always with the same result. Yeah, John, good evening to you and a hotly discussed topic right now once again. But after tonight's meeting, that decades old ban on drive through drive throughs will remain in place in most parts of the city. My job is to protect the unique character of Palm Desert. No new drive throughs is the decision from Palm Desert City Council Thursday, rejecting a proposal that would have lifted a 40 year old ban on the convenient fast food pickup along Highway 111 and Fred Waring Drive. The proposal addressing environmental concerns, oversaturation of drive throughs and design standards required to be met. But for now, drive throughs will remain banned everywhere in the city except for commercial areas near Interstate 10. Local restaurants calling into city council worried about the threat of competition. I believe that the presence of corporate fast food drive throughs would be a threat to them. They could be put out of business. Concerns that the existing non drive through fast food franchises would become non competitive as well. We would end up with several empty structures, difficult to fill. But two city leaders were in favor. Councilmember Gina Nastande pushing for fewer limits on drive throughs. We need to give our residents choice. For those that want to do a drive through, they can have that option, but not to go drive five or six miles to the, the 10 freeway. This, this developer hopes to breathe new life into the Palms to Pines shopping center on Highway 111, including putting in a new Raising Canes drive through Everybody's trying to get as much traffic in as they can. And this is a huge traffic generator. Despite a landscaping design that city council enjoyed, it's back to the drawing board for him. It does not eliminate greenhouse gases. And it doesn't protect our air quality. Council voting three to two to uphold the drive through ban, saying if someone is desperate for one, there are no shortage of drive throughs in Palm Desert or in the Coachella Valley. A drive through is just a short drive away. And City Council tonight directed city staff to go back and look at the ordinances that allow drive throughs here near Interstate 10, potentially looking for opportunities to add even more of them in this area. We're live tonight. Jaden Gracia, News Channel 3, Palm Desert.